Ladies and gentlemen, we have a release date. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Caboose bringing you a Gotham Knights video that I have been waiting to bring you guys. There have been people in my comment section constantly say, Caboose, do we have any updates on this game? Caboose, what's going on with Gotham Knights? Well, finally, I have an update for you and it's a really good one. It's a juicy one, so get excited. Before we jump into everything though, if you're looking forward to Gotham Knights, which is coming out this year, well then scroll down right now and hit that thumbs up button. Share your excitement with me. If you're looking forward to seeing some new trailers and gameplay being kept up to date on Gotham Knights, well I got you covered on all of that. You can look forward to all that stuff right here on this channel. So hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications to be immediately notified when a video goes live. And with that being said, let's get into the news that I'm sure a lot of you have been waiting for. They tweeted earlier today on the Gotham Knights social channels what the release date for the game actually is. It's confirmed. The tweet reads, Gotham will always need its heroes. Suit up for an all new adventure on 10, 25 at 2022 which is of course october 25th later this year in the fall accompanying the tweet is a brand new image that we get of the clock tower as well as a brief glimpse at potentially the open world that we're going to be able to free roam around in in gotham knights and on the clock tower it is timed at 10 25 p.m which is of course the actual release date october 25th this release date is also very special for another reason that's a huge coincidence almost to the point where it doesn't feel like a coincidence so gotham knights is coming out on october 25th and when this game does launch later this year, it'll be the nine year anniversary of the exact day that Batman Arkham Origins came out, which was also developed by WB Montreal. How crazy is that? And almost like a full circle moment for the folks at WB Montreal that an entire nine years since their last game, they're still in the Batman universe and they're creating an all new universe with Gotham Knights that isn't tied to the Arkhamverse, something that they can have full creative control over and not have to worry about continuity at all. It's something that I really look forward to. Gotham Knights, everything that we've seen from it looks incredible in my opinion, and I am very hyped for this game, and I'm so glad that we now have an official release date. This is the first time that we've known an exact day of when to expect this game to come out. But now begs the question, we got this image, we got the release date, we know when Gotham Knights is gonna be in our hands and finally available to play and see in full, but when are we gonna get a brand new trailer? When are we gonna get an idea on some things like pre-order bonuses, a look into some of the gear and the customization that's gonna be available, maybe a glimpse of some other villains that are gonna be in the game? When's that gonna happen? Well, first of all, a PlayStation State of Play is taking place later today, and that is going to feature a look at a lot of Japanese published games, and apparently a little glimpse at some stuff outside of that. So if there is something for Gotham Knights, well, I'll be kicking myself because I've already made this video, but I will react to it and showcase it for you guys. If it's not during the PlayStation State to Play though, then I'd say maybe there's an expectation for something to be revealed at some point in either April, next month, or maybe in the summer during something like Summer Game Fest. Now, why do I say April? Well, hear me out. If we rewind all the way back to 2013 and 2014 respectively, well, Game Informer had their cover reveals for Batman Arkham Origins and Batman Arkham Knight during those years. Arkham Origins had its cover reveal and its official reveal during Game Informer's coverage in April of 2013, and then that game came out in October of 2013. Arkham Knight had its official reveal through Game Informer as well in April of 2014 and was originally slated to release in October of 2014. It ended up getting delayed, but that's besides the point. I could definitely see a scenario in which Gotham Knights gets its cover reveal through Game Informer and they're going to do a month long worth of coverage for the game in April of this year for a release date of October 25th this year. To add on to that, Andrew Reiner, working at Game Informer, has stated multiple times to people tweeting at him that he is trying to get the Gotham Knights exclusive and he really wants to have a cover and a month long worth of coverage dedicated 
to that game. Game Informer is very respected in the industry. I mean, Andrew Reiner is very respected in the industry, so I could definitely see this happening. And if not next month, if we're not going to get anything in April, well, then again, like I said, expect something potentially during the summer. That's when a lot of game reveals happen and take place. The summertime, for the most part, is always feeling like E3. Even if E3 isn't there, we treat the summer like it's E3. And who knows? Although last year's DC fandom was in October, the first DC fandom in 2020 was in August. So maybe Maybe there's going to be another DC fandom in August and we'll get another reveal for Gotham Knights there and hopefully something as well for Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League. And with that being said, now I want to kick it to you guys. Let me know your thoughts on all of this in the comments section below. First of all, are you excited that we finally got a release date for Gotham Knights? Are you looking forward to the game dropping on October 25th, 2022? And also, when do you think we're going to get another trailer? Sound off with all your thoughts in the comments section below. And if you enjoyed today's video, if you could consider hitting that thumbs up button it would show your support and i would really appreciate it i'm caboose and you can click on screen to make your way to one of the other videos on the channel or you can click my logo to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already you can also follow me on instagram and twitter those links are going to be in the description drop a like if you enjoyed leave a comment if you have an opinion and subscribe if you're new see you guys later